boys. I've done the number crunching. I've done the calculations. And after long and hard work, our total time for the five games, five wins in a row in Ceramic Crucible was... Yo, what is up, boys? It's your boy, Ryan Mahalik here, and I'm coming at you with a bit of a different video. We're going into Ceramic Crucible, and what we're trying to do is we're trying to win games um, as quickly as possible, basically. Zigzag Power did a video like this where he won five games pretty quick, actually. Pretty darn quick. So we're trying to do the same thing here. Um, Obviously, we're going to be facing noobs. So we're gonna be doing like round 13 all outs and stuff. Maybe get round eight all outs in. Maybe kill some people then. We'll have to wait and see if we can accomplish that journey. But I'll catch you guys in the first game. All right, so it looks like our first game is against Ashton Holiday. And uh, my friend Jersey allowed me to use his account. So shout out to him. Pretty poggers, if I do say so myself. Ashton is saying late game. Um, I don't know about that, Ashton. We're gonna go Dartling Boomer, I guess. Hit him with the Geo. I could go Dartling Cobra, then go for offensive pushes. But I don't know, that's really risky. That is risky. Uh, obviously gonna start with an anti-stall here. We wanna keep these rounds short and sweet. And they're anti-stalling as well, so that's great for us. Just what we wanted. And he already got up his powerful darts as well. Oh man. Thank you, dude. Wait, how did he get up his powerful darts so quick? I didn't even have money for it. What? Is this guy cheating? I think he got up his powerful darts before I even had money for mine. I'm confused. I'm really confused. Oh no, he's sending me. Get that up. Wait, I'm three thirty dollars off. This is bad. These rounds are being too long. We'll boost here. Since it's gonna only go to around thirteen around then, I am fine boosting. I want to keep these rounds short. There we go. Oh, he got up his faster firing, I guess. Interesting. Well done. Maybe we can kill him on round eight. Dartling's not good against yellows. We'll wait and see. If we can get a round eight rush on him to catch him off guard. You got the Bluntonium. He's tower boosting. I don't think that's enough. We're gonna keep sending. We got him down. That's cold, boys. That's game one, 219. That's quick. That's quick. All right, let's do another one. Wait, no, not against him. We can't play against him again. I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right. Oh, we found Kiwi Ace, dude. Is this the real Kiwi Ace? I don't think it is. Because I'm going to say that we... If it was the real Kiwi Ace, that'd be bad. Okay, Zen Garden's a good map for us. It's a short map. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't skip. Oh, he skips, okay. Concrete Alley, we don't want Concrete Alley. <laughs> Glacier Melt, let's go. Let's go, bro. I'm gonna go this. Dartling will anti-stall better, which is what I want. We'll place it at the bottom right corner.
He's farming as well, it looks like. I honestly probably could have went Cobra this game in offensive push round 12. Since it's really hard to defend all outs on this map. So he's sending me. Barely though. We're gonna get up our um powerful darts either way. He got up his grape shot. Okay, he sent me pinks. We, we forced his faster shooting. We should be able to force more than that on this map. We're gonna bloom boost, because it's gonna end really soon anyways, so. I'm fine using bloom boost. He's using all his spikes, it looks like. Okay. Guess we'll target our dartling this way now. Can't anti-stall as well, but it is what it is. Here he has two grape shots up, so we're fine against... Um, he's fine against whatever we send, pretty much. I don't think we're going to be able to kill him round eight, sadly. I don't think so. With Buccaneer, we'll probably just... Boost. He's got Wizard. Oh, that's perfect for us. Everyone loves Wizard. I don't understand on this map. But that's so good that he's going Wizard. We'll get up a second Dartling. In case he sends us yellows, we can boost two of them and defend. Keep these rounds short. All right, we're gonna rush him on round 11. What is he doing right now? Please boost. Or die. He boosted. And he's dead. Let's go. 311. Second game. Oh my. Let's go, chat. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Alright, so for the next game, we got um Carid SW. I don't know who this is. He's got about 5,000 meds. Glacier Mount once again. Let's go. Don't skip. Do we go Cobra here? I'm scared to go Cobra. We've had two really good games, and I don't want to, like, mess up the streak right here, boys. So I'm not going to go Cobra. I'm not going to go Cobra. Hopefully this guy goes with Buck Wiz again. Or, like, the last guy. He's going Tack. Okay. Well, we can send Camels against Tack, even though he has the Maelstrom. Big tax sprayer guy over there. He already got up his tax sprayer. We'll get this powerful darts up. We should be able to perfectly afford our our um, farm here at forty eight seconds. He's anti stalling the rounds as well, so that's really good for us. I've probably said anti-stall so many times in this video already. So let's get an anti-stall counter going. If anyone, wants to, if anyone wants to tally those up, feel free. We're gonna boost here because I'm like that. I don't need boosts and I'd rather boost and just farm harder. Oh, I don't even have more bananas. That is a rip in the chat. Go.
Come on, get another. There we go. Cool. We're fine. I feel like we can kill him in round eight. Actually, he's been econ so hard. Please. Where's the balloons? Come on, come on. Let's go, buddy. 223, third game. Oh, we're flying, boys. We're flying. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Okay, so we got boss player 48 for this third game. He's got about 2k on meds on him. Ink plot. Let's go. Ink plot's good. Good luck. Don't skip, please. Don't skip. Don't skip. Don't skip. Awesome. He did not skip. Cool. Obviously, start off with an anti-stall. He's going wizard off the start. That's great. That is great, dude. Imagine if we can kill him with, like, blacks or something. That would be amazing. We're going for a farm since he's not sending anything. We'll spike right up here as well. Does he have lightning? Oh, he does. Let's go, bro. Both anti-stalling so hard right now. If he sends me pinks, we'll upgrade to a grape shot. If not, we're just gonna farm on. Oh, this game's going so well right now, though. Okay, he's got farms as well. We'll get up a grape shot now against AI. Send him some blacks here. I don't know if this is actually smart. It's going to cause leaks, but I don't want him to have much defense going into round 8, you know? Because I want him to be susceptible to die to pinks and stuff. So I don't know if that was honestly smart. Maybe I should just wait. Does he have lightning on the bottom one now? Hopefully not. He does. Oh my gosh, bro. That's not good for us. We're gonna have to wait till round 13 to all out him. We're fine against whatever he's sending now. <sighs> okay. Unless we get lucky with whites. Please get lucky. He boosts. All right, well, he's gonna defend that then. He's dead. GG's. All right. I'll catch you guys in the next one. That was 315. Still a good time. Still a good time. Okay, looks like we got Q8 Lolua. Another noob. Please have a sh short map. Shallow river. It double, it double loops in the middle, which is a bit concerning, but it's really easy to leak on this map. I think we'll go for it. Yeah, good luck. 
Okay, cool. Um, man, maybe we should have thought this out better. Maybe we should have brought um, Dartling, cause, oh, okay, that is the, an interesting play I've not seen before. I was saying maybe we should have brought Dartling because we can't really anti-test all these rounds with a tower, which is the problem. This is pretty much the best we can do for anti-stalling. Man likes his bomb tower though. He's got the missile launcher going. Constance and pinks. Dude, he's leaking actually. Bloom boost. He's got heli. Okay, he should be fine now. He's already got the quad darts up. How are we gonna kill him, though? I don't know. All right. We have to figure out a strategy to kill this guy. Maybe if he has bad targeting, he'll die to blocks. Balloon boost them. He has he's out, out on patrol right now. Uh balloon boosting was probably not the play. Because we only have one left now. I need to stop rushing him. What am I doing? Because he might just get more defense then. Please boost, or actually just go down. Yeah, can you just go down? He boosted. Do we kill him in round 11? Oh dude, this is rough. I don't know what the game plan is. I think he'll have his boost back on round 11 though. We'll have to wait and see. Oh, I said two sets, which is an accident. Is he dead? Let's go, bro. 325. Is that game four? I'll check the recording real quick, but yeah. Boys, I've done the number crunching. I've done the calculations. And after long and hard work, our total time for the five games, five wins in a row in Ceramic Crucible was... Dun, dun, dun. 14 minutes and 33 seconds. So we have outdid, done um, zigzag power and... I don't know if other YouTubers want to try this. Maybe no monies, maybe Asian sensation. I'm calling you guys out. Let's see if you guys can get a better time. I'm pretty happy with my 1433. I think that's a pretty fast time for this challenge. Um, had a lot of quick games in there. I'll put down all the game results on the screen right here. But yeah, if you guys um enjoyed this type of content, make sure to let me know in the comment section down below. And yeah. I Yo, what is up, boys? We are back again with another cough series. And we are playing, please, DC 4C11. Well, this is a friendly matchup, my guy. So, yeah, I'm not going to be helping you with your med count today, it looks like. Hopefully, he readies up here. There we go. Cool. So, um, tower bands are NG and Cobra. So, we have our Dartling Tower this time around. He'll probably go Dartling as well, I'm guessing. We'll hit him with a high. Okay, good. He's going Dartling too. Go high eagle start. 
We'll see if he got, does the same. I kind of like when both people go like 277 or 275 because um, it's a bit more of an aggressive game, less farms, that type of stuff. So it's a bit more fun that way, in my opinion. We'll get up our powerful darts. He did the same. So we both went 275. Fair enough. Fair enough. Cool. Um, oh crap. I was just late to place my farm. I wasn't paying attention. Alright. Well, hopefully we still get two nanners. I hope. Please. Okay, there's our second nanner. Awesome. So us placing the farm late did not change anything, it looks like. We do have a spectator. I wonder who is potatoing us. Who is the potato? Do we, um... What? We're a dollar off, dude. That is unlucky. One dollar short. How does that even happen? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, bro. I am angry at that. He probably just got like one or two extra bananas. See, now he's getting his farm up before us, all because we're a dollar short. It's like a snowball effect, boys. It is a snowball effect. Let's see if he goes to his farm here. Hopefully we force a cluster. There we go, cool. Wait, he sells it? Um, okay. He's almost dead. I mean, I guess he greeted more with that, but we forced a boost and tons of leaks. So, at what cost, I guess? You know? At what cost? affords it well done so we're getting out farmed really hard right now which isn't ideal but I wouldn't say we're in a bad position he's gonna have to over defend and stuff for being low on lives while well, we haven't leaked anything whole game We boosted there. So we both got up a bank. <laughs> He's going for his BIA. Uh, we'll do the same. We're in a much better position though, because we have a ton more eco than him. He barely sent us anything. 
and we're tired in boosts, we have a huge life advantage. We send this mobile cash out. But yeah, we're in a much better position. I think we're both gonna have to cash out for a BFB to defend it. Is he sending me one? Yeah, he is. We're just going to defend with this. Cool. Simple defend. So we're both down to one boost. I still think we have the equal lead. But as I told you, this is gonna be a little farm game because of how we started and everything. How much do these both sell for? 7,000 about? So I need 7,000. Okay. He's sending us a BFB, a Moab. It's actually a good send. Forced to cash out. Well done. That was smart on his part. I mean, of course it costs $1,500 and drains a bit of eco, but I don't know. Definitely smarter than a BFB. See, we have the, I don't know why he sold his BIA like that though. We had to sell ours because we cashed out for the mob. But he didn't have to sell his in that scenario. That was dumb for him, I think. I don't think that was very smart. <clears throat> he just got up his second. This should force a boost or something. Is he fine? Bad rush on our part. I really thought we were gonna force a boost there. That was a really dumb rush. That was a bad rush, boys. A waste of like $5,000. It would have been a good rush if we forced a boost, but I guess his dartlings handled. Does he really handle that? Oh no, he gets up a cluster as well. Okay. So we still have an out farm, at least, even with the bad rush. Do we, gr no, we can't greed. We cannot greed.
Oh my. We almost died there. Okay. Well, we're still vibing. I don't know why this AI is pushing so hard on our side. In comparison to his. Do you just have bad targeting or something? I'm not sure. Well, now we're farming pretty well. We're up a facility about... Got up our laser cannon, he did the same thing. Cool. We're gonna go one more farm. Should handle. Yeah, we do. We're gonna rush him here soon. We both only have one boost. Okay. Get ready to rush. Is he going for defend? I don't think he defends that. He already used his boost. Sell these, sell these, sell these. Yes, let's go. We didn't want to pop the things because if we wanted to slow our balloons to go. GG's. We'll see where this map is. Alright, so his losing map was Temple. Um, we're running Dartling Glue. I'm guessing he's going to do the same. I could have won DFA, honestly. Oh, he is going DFA. Okay. Hmm. Go um 259. Keep this anti-stall all flowing as well. We want these rounds to fly by.
Gonna do a quick layer on our boy. He is not, okay, he is sending us. We're gonna spike right there, just so when he's sending us, um, we still anti-stole, even if we target our dartling. Well, we forced a second trip dart with minimal um, sins, so I'm happy with that. We'll just keep the anti-stall flowing. He sold it. Okay. I guess that's fine. He tower boosted. Making him send more than he wants to. That was my goal. So he's gonna need more than two trips here. Looks like he's vibing now. All right, he's sending me again. This man's playing aggro. It's interesting. I should pick up those leaks pretty well. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna force, force a sport here. Honestly, he might leak a bit to this because of the layering. And he did. Awesome. That's awesome. I'm sending him on round 9 as well. Okay, force the second sport. Cool. Send him a lud. Oh my gosh, bro. This glue gunner's fumble in the bag so hard. Harder than your mom. He's still sending leads for some reason. Can you send pinks or something? I mean, whites. What is going on? Okay, went first farm. We'll go for ours. He hasn't forced my camel lead detection. We're gonna do the classic rush here. That might be death. It is, all right. Yep, you need to boost that. Um. All right, well, GG's to um, Super John Blowjob. And um, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button down below with your forehead. Also, subscribe for more daily content. Your boy Ryan is pumping out as much content as possible. Road to 2K, baby. Ryan Mahalik out. Peace out, boys.